Wibbidi-wibbidi-boo, hey there everyone, this is Alcal playing Megalex uh, 3, level 10, we're in world 10, world 10 out of 12, it's, it's hard to believe it, but there's actually an end in sight, <laughs> yay, I mean, we are like 80, 80 videos in though, like, I mean, like, calling this fine, like, like, finally or whatever, look at that amazing effect of like, all these stones rotating around that massive crystal. That looks so cool. Anyways. Ooh, alright, what's the next one? With all the lights. Ooh, that's a lot of clocks. Well, let's see what happens. Uh, 50th, uh, 35th place by 14th order. More and more I recognize names. Let's think about Water and Rex Part 2. That reference, yes! Very high, tightly distributed score there, and we got two lights focusing on that crystal. We'll make sure you got a good old eyeball on it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. If you don't recognize this from Megalex 2, that's your fault. Uh, I did it! Uh, no, something's gonna happen. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, that's so good. <laughs> Alright, I love tours, it's the enemy research lab. <laughs> you know, it's for people that just joined in late. <laughs> oh man, they are maximizing Rex productivity. These toads hats are giant compared to the other ones. Uh, okay, so Super Rexes. <laughs> I don't know what accent that is. Uh, hey, it's Dr. Mario. Uh, okay, Galoomba, huh? Several new types, different properties. Uh, Alright, well, we teleported. Uh, <laughs> why did you teleport like that? That's just being weird. Alright, welcome to the Cyber Zone. With all the Galoombas. Alright, you're gonna lose a lot of points for that. But sometimes art comes at a price. I'm bad at video games. Oh, and I lost all my progress here, too. All right, there you go. That's how you do that. Here we go. Here we go. Look at that lava. It's just like a zippy zap. My favorite type of lava. <laughs> favorite kind of thing to talk about. All right, and then you go here. Let's make a level all about bouncing things on yellow blocks. I'm sure that's gonna change. All right, look at that. Uh, kick. Yeah, there we go. I got a plant. Ooh, what's this? What are these? What do these blocks mean? Like, no Manuelo here? I mean, I'm sorry if that's her name. Like, poof, yeah, see, this appeared. He's just gone. Can I chuck it? Is it just like a no holding a thing? But it's okay if you toss the thing? Eh, it sure is, but then you gotta work on your angle. But here it disappeared from my hands. Yeah, alright, uh, and then you can go like, uh, there we go. So I had to be more aggressive so that it would bounce more. It makes a lot of sense if you apply any- Whoa, what's up with you? You got cool glasses. Um, then you killed me, like, immediately. Yeah, I'm not gonna get up there like that, though. Uh, like, what's the story here? Why did you jump so much? So when you come out of the tube, you jump out super high. Now there's just like bodies everywhere. Wait, what am I- what am I supposed to do though? Like, do they float in the air? No. They do stay conked out for a long time. But, like, I just- can I spin jump on you and fly? No. What is happening here? Am I supposed to- I can't, no, I wouldn't be able to, like, wall jump on you. Uh, oh, they make you glide. Naturally. That makes sense. Yeah! Alright, they're like blue blocks from, um, from jump. Uh, like, the, the blue plus Y, though, is, like, way on top of the screen. Alright, you know what, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Oh, yeah, but you do not interact with enemies. So, what I gotta do is knock these guys around, yeah, uh-huh, 
See, I'm gonna toss that guy up there and miss entirely what I'm trying to do. And do it again. There you go. And I'm gonna use you. Get up here. Then do that. And I can't bring you because I can't duck while holding a thing. Alright, we're figuring things out. Oh, that guy, he's in a hurry and he's aggressive. Uh, it's time to take the time to smell a flower. Look at that guy, though. He's just there. Did it. Alright. You're frozen now for me. It's time to destroy the world. Yes, sirree. How? I want to. What does that mean? Why are you gray? Oh, that's what that means. You die and you become a pow? That's incredible. All right, naturally, who wouldn't assume such a ridiculous thing? All right, back to you, here you go, transform into an object, and then you're like, get on down. Why, what does that mean? I don't know, can you run? Okay, I need like a P-switch probably, I need a P-switch there probably. Is there another way to get there? Then like, uh, yeah, that, that's not gonna work, like this is not, the intended path, I'm sure. It's the one that I took. Uh, you know what? We're all back to how things were, so webs. So now you can run along on the little brick road. That's right, little buddy. Now you can fall here. And I can do that by accident. Uh, uh, ice. Why you gotta do that? Alright, well, reset. Hey, I lost my blue guy. All right, and that bops you back here. All right. I still don't know how you get past here, though. Oh, like that. All right, you see, that was an opportunity to redo that jump good. All right. Man, I am getting destroyed by the fact that I'm holding an ice flower, though. All right, so you gotta be careful around this. So, there you go. I'm holding Y in such a way that I will not be affected by earthly delights. Here we go! Uh-oh, hey, I'm back! There's a rotodisc! Watch out, rotodisc- Oh, it's very real, huh? Just out there, out on the field, spinning around, no one understands. Uh, oh, alright, orbless rotodisc, why? Return me- <laughs> Hey, another Horikawa reference, that's- Alright, uh... <laughs> Okay then, let us go inside this obelisk. There we go. We just got we got roto disc now that are basically munchers, uh, the scariest kind. Uh, all right, well if you see money, run. That's my cue. We got ourselves. Okay, yeah. See see the way it's solid there. Yeah, it's totally. Oh, that guy is moving though. He's snaking around. Oh, uh, but like it's like pulsating and it's very uncomfortable. What am I looking at there? What happened to this level? Um. Okay. <laughs> you got me. Like you got me good there. I was absolutely tricked. Oh. Uh, uh. All right, well, still in the laboratory base where things can ha- oh, dang it. Your angle of flight there, just wonderful. All right, let's just- Why did everything stop? Woo, uh, SMBX has crashed. Uh, you can't see it on UBS here. Um, uh, doesn't really tell me much. Stack track for a bunch of thing and update block. I'm gonna send the server. But then the game just crashed. Huh. I wonder what caused that. Alright, so yeah, I used cheats to get back to here. I, I don't know what caused things to break. Like, it was around here. Alright, I managed to make it through this time, so I guess things are okay. That's gonna mess up with your jump, so be careful. Here we are. Like, I have to assume it's something interacting with... Falling in the lava or something, right? Like, that's the classic, uh, classic, I did not do that. Oh, I was supposed to have a, a blue guy in hand. <laughs> I just kind of went. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that would happen. All right, 
Ah, hey, here we go. I got myself an officially sanctioned pause. Hey, Sir Rex. Ma'am. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, oh, really? See, not, I, I don't mind restarting there. I, I could have played that better, but I'm just afraid of crashes because I don't know what caused it. Uh, I don't think I want ice as a thing. There's my blue thing. Earthquake's happening. There's one up up here if you need it. I mean, you don't need lives, but you know, if you need it. Yeah, so, so give me a chance to do this like you're supposed to. Here you go. Carefully glide through the world. Forget all that you know. Yeah, that's a pretty tight fit. And here, that's actually really ridiculous. Dang it. Oh, so you see, it like, it just goes better if you just take the hit and go through. Because if I had used the slowing ability of my guy there, I, I, I would have, like, lost invincibility and died. So here, I think it wants you to slam him. So you see, oh, I see, oh, there's that guy. There you go. Hey. And I squish all of their necks, yo. All right, check it out, it's a red door. Are you the boss? I just went through a boss door, Mario. What's up with that? Talk to my neck. What's around here about a Galoomba project? Oh, no! Uh, okay, sounds good. Uh, can you appear me? Yeah, the sound effect appeared again. This level was a lot of fun. It was really silly. I don't know why it crashed. That was strange. Like, I just do not have an explanation. I'm not good enough in code to really figure it out. Man, so now I'm like, I'm approaching. I, I cannot justify stepping into a three and a half clock level. Maybe we can look around the place and look for a place to die. Laboratory, yeah, all of this digital, sure, Galoomba and Rododisk, here to smile. <laughs> oh yeah, that, just, just in terms of concept, this was real good, this was real fun. Ooh, music here, starting for real, too. It was, like, borderline the setup level, because it's, it's, like, it's weirdly, like, independent little areas, but it's put together very well. And no bosses. <laughs> like, this level is really good, too, with just setting up expectation, then, like, blasting you in the face. Like, with the intro and the fake out with the yellow, uh, obstacle course. But yeah, blue Galoomba's being propellers, that's not obvious. <laughs> it's kind of sad how willing we're just ready to accept that yeah yellow path just turns into this insane weird hard zone we're just ready to accept that as the reality <gasps> doesn't look like anyone speaking about crashes so it might be a new thing like a new engine thing i don't know like a post patch difficulty arium Think about Rex and water. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Like, throwing the Loombas at wall is just not great. Like, the PAL ones is fine. But you can throw one Galoomba at one yellow wall and you get it. You do not need to do that five times. Like, that is accurate. That is actually accurate. Flip, flip, flip! Looks like it's only the oh no! <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, no, I cannot justify this. So let's look around. Maybe I can, you can get a sense for thing. Ooh, I don't know who you are, but you're here. Ooh, two stars. Okay, but see, overall, there's uh, an award winner of some kind. There's a Mafab. I'm not actually looking very well for places to die. I'm just kind of going. Oh, okay. So, so we still got is that rock. Okay, I'm not gonna talk to it because we're not there yet. So overall the stats are eh, There is a distribution of stats All right. Oh, what's this? I'm gonna go down Is this where you die? I wonder let's try and go like off-screen in weird places I think that therein lies the secret to an early grave maybe 
I have no idea. I don't know why I said that. Hmm, I don't know. I just don't seem to be dying right now. There's my fabler, and then I will say wow. Um, you do have plenty of space to run here. All right, let me get like a uh, way to fly it. Maybe fly up there. Really? Nothing? But it's just so odd. Okay, it's because I'm using Luigi. Like, there's something going on here. There's DDD. I flew here, right? Our vivid dance hall is very popular among creatures I can fly too. VIP dance hall. Alright, uh, that might be world 11 or 12, so flying for one of these. Uh, Museum sa the museum safety rating is a scam. They just hide their crimes with a cleverly placed camera track. So you die off camera. And here you can veer off camera, but. Oops. Holding left or right. Yeah, let's try different holding things, different directions. Ah, so I kept holding down. I just kept holding down. See though, now at this time I did play for like half an hour, so next time we're gonna return here and see what's up with that. <laughs> what a weird, awkward something that just happened.